Hi, I'm Jala Sanar and welcome to this episode of the Big Bang Data series. In the previous episode, I talked about some of the challenges that the content operation teams are facing right now and two of the recommendations that can help to optimize some of their media workflows, generating metadata and understanding audience engagement. In the previous episode, we talked about generating metadata. And in today's video, let's dive into understanding audience engagement and how we have applied that for one of our global entertainment companies. So the company is a global entertainment company based in North America, and they entertain millions of fans and audiences worldwide through their live performances. Traditionally, the company distributed feedback forms at the end of their live performances to better understand their overall audience engagement. However, they found that the feedback form didn't always capture audiences' reactions as required. The responses were also heavily influenced by the last few minutes of the shows. It was also challenging to analyze whether a performance met its intended goal, which part of the play the audience connected more to, as well as which actor played a certain role better, and so on. So the company decided to measure the impact in real time throughout the entire timeline of their performances. And for this task, they decided to engage with Media Agility, a Google Cloud Premier Partner, to build a minimum viable model using Media Agility's patent pending solution on Google Cloud Platform. The MVM measured the impact by processing the video capture of audiences' reactions. Before running the videos through the MVM, they were also pre-processed and enhanced with color correction as well as brightness check. So the MVM had two defined video processing pipelines and each pipeline automatically ingested and processed videos from Google Cloud Storage. With that said, I'd like to hand it over to my colleague, Christina Eberhardt, to talk us through the two video processing pipelines. Over to you, Christina, and thank you so much for joining us in this episode today. Thanks, Jala. Really happy to be here today and to discuss this exciting customer story. So as mentioned, the MVM had two pipelines. The first pipeline was facial sentiment analysis. The videos were sent to a Google Vision API for face detection using deep learning, while another deep learning model quantified the emotions shown on each face recognized in the video on a range of negative 50 to positive 50. These results were then displayed on a timeline showing the various emotions and their intensities. This allowed the customer to measure the performance's impact based on their intended emotional timeline to the audience's actual emotional timeline throughout the performance. The second pipeline was action detection analysis. A deep learning based action detection model measured applause based on the video's temporal information and by processing a set of frames sequentially. Being able to know when and what part of the audience is applauding in the performance gave the customer insight as to the overall audience engagement throughout that performance. And lastly, this MVM model was delivered in three weeks, providing the following value adds to the customer. First, facial detection and emotional classification, allowing them to measure the performance's impact. Two, applause measurement to understand audience engagement. And three, Media Agility and the customer are looking at additional pipelines to measure things such as emotion within audio or analyzing the overall ambiance, such as whether people are leaving or entering the venue, as well as looking at a ratio of empty to filled seats within the venue and many more pipelines for better understanding and analysis. And with that, I'm turning it back over to you, Jala. Thank you so much for having me here today. Excellent. And thank you so much for running us through that, Christina. So in the next episode, which I hope that you will be tuning in for, 
we'll be covering a new topic relevant for the media and entertainment industry. So tune in for that and see you then.